This is an intro to Max Weber bureaucratic model. Max Weber used the term bureaucracy in the 19th century. He described bureaucracy as an effective mechanism of administration and organization within the state. Then the question is how it should be defined? Bureaucracy can be defined as Bureaucracy is an organizational structure that is characterized by many rules, standardized processes, procedures and requirements, number of desks, the meticulous division of labor and responsibility, clear hierarchies and professional, almost impersonal interactions between employees. Moreover, there are three elements of a bureaucratic model that are as follows. All regular activities within a bureaucracy can be regarded as official duties. Management has the authority to impose rules. Rules can easily be respected based on established methods. It is considered to be the most formalized and ideal form of management for a state in classical conception. Bureaucracy works on six principles. Task specialization. Hierarchical authority. Formal selection. Rules and requirements. Impersonal. Career orientation. More so. As far as the merits of bureaucratic model are concerned. In larger organizations, the division of labor is a useful tool to be more structured and systematic in its function. The rules and regulations improve the efficiency of the workers in the organization. Furthermore, the hierarchy helps in maintaining control and increasing the output of the organization. The bureaucratic model has its demerits along with merits like any other model of governance. The slow communication between different layers of hierarchies becomes a hurdle in the decision-making process. Similarly, the paperwork for the routine work causes a delay in policy implementation.